what's going on guys welcome back to another review so before I start this review I just want to say today starts the pre-recorded video so all of this week's videos by the time this video comes out I mean I'm filming this on Saturday but of course this video is coming out on a Monday so all of this week as this video is going out all of these videos will be pre-recorded except for my next Adventures from Radiator Springs episode for episode 14 that will be the only like you know not pre-recorded video of the week this video is also coming out so I just wanted to remind you of that since my cousins are coming for Thanksgiving I'm really looking forward to that and since of course I'm not going to be filming during that I decided to pre-record all of my videos on a Saturday so of course the Saturday before the Monday which this review is coming out is when I'm pre-recording all the videos for the upcoming week so I'm sorry if that sounded confusing but sometimes it's just how it has to be. So I do hope you guys enjoy this review and now let's get into it. So of course in this pack we've got Tailgate, which I don't have, Sigler, which I do. We'll, get, we'll be comparing them to the single right after we open them both up. So of course I only have one more two pack to review out of this whole entire case and that is High Impact and Jimbo. So I will be reviewing them very soon as well. Let's go ahead and open them up. Alright, 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 so here are the both diecasts out of the package. So I already think I may like Tailgate more than Sigler. Let's go ahead and take out the more boring ones. Since Sigler is not a variant, I don't believe, he is exactly the same as his single release. There's literally, you know, nothing different. Just like when I reviewed, you know, Pushover with Blind Spot. Pushover had no differences since his last single was released. And of course, it's the same deal with Sigler. We've got no differences whatsoever. Same 22, same American colors, same looking wheels, tires, same stuff that says on the back, you know, like bring it, still got the white star, same stripes, antennas, plastics, everything is exactly the same. So, yeah, that's all I'm going to say about Ziggler since I already have gone in detail of him, you know, when I reviewed him as his single release, I remember that was like a couple months ago, it feels like now. So let's go ahead and take the Sigler from the two pack out of here as well. And let's take a look at Sig. No, oh my gosh, not Sigler, I meant Tailgate. So actually, let's go ahead and compare also, you know, Tailgate with Sigler because I know they obviously are two very different models, but we'll do that right after we talk about some of her really cool features. She has a very surprised look and expression there. She definitely looks like she, like someone's about to run into her, like maybe from the side, on the front. I don't know. She just looks very worried from her expression. You can see here on the side, it says number 88. Same thing on the top and this side on like her door is kind of all right in the background. And I like like the messy look. Kind of reminds me of like that graffiti feel. How half of her how half of her tires are black, other other part is white. That's how it is on the other three as well. And these two white stripes that are actually going across her whole entire body, which looks really cool. I definitely am a big fan of Tailgate. She looks very nice. And then on the back, it says, bring, bring the pain. I, I like that it says that. It's kind of cool. And then on the side, it says, the Greasy Girl BBQ. So that may have been like her previous job, maybe before she started competing in the demolition derby i'm not exactly sure on that but it does kind of seem like it'd be like you know like a job before she starts you know crashing into cars and banging into you know you get the idea so she's definitely very nice i definitely do like the pink and white color they go very well together and here's the base as well of course obviously the most least interesting thing on of all of her features so let's go ahead and take a look at her with Sigler so Sigler is quite a bit wider a little bit longer but I think wait let's I'm gonna get real close here let's see uh, I don't know when I'm looking at them like really really close they look like they're the exact same height yeah like not gonna lie I mean like their width and you know how long they are is different but like they just seem like they're like pretty much the exact same height. That's what it looks like from where I'm looking at it, but That may be wrong. Maybe it is right because if not, they're definitely very similar. I'll just say that So of course they've got many differences of course 
Her number is 88, his is 22. He's sporting more of the American colors. You know, he's definitely got more the patriotic stuff on him, while Tailgate has just, you know, random pink and white colors on her. And a little bit of red, you know, on the on both of her doors. So definitely, they look really cool together, and they definitely, you know, fit well as a two-pack. I think they look really good together as a two-pack. So, very, very nice. Well, that will do it for this review, so I hope everyone enjoyed, and tell me in the comment section below, who was your favorite out of the two? Mine is for sure Tailgate. Make sure you tell me in the comment section below if you would like to, and as always, we will see you guys next time for another review. Hope you guys are having a great break as well.